We should throw the people responsible for this oil spill right into the Gulf of Mexico with the oil. Emmy-nominated American Morning, CNN, weekday, 6 Eastern. We've been able to see that slick on the top. We've been able to see the oil spewing out at the bottom of the ocean. But the, all that area in between has been a great unknown. The satellites can't see it. We haven't been able to see it with the human eye until now. We got our own submersible, our own little ROV, about the size of a suitcase. We put it in the water about 20 miles away from the source of the leak in the Gulf of Mexico. We went under the water. First of all, we saw these uh, huge plumes, these, uh, these bands of emulsified oil that we are very familiar with now stretching out from horizon to horizon on the Gulf. We went down in the water right into one of those bands. We saw the emulsified oil after it's come in contact with the dispersant. What we really were surprised to see here was how deep it went. We were seeing these particles of oil, these emulsified particles, going down 50 feet down into the water column. So that was a little bit of a surprise for us. We also continued to go down very deep. We took this submersible all the way down to 1,000 feet below. We went all the way down to the bottom where we were, and we were able to see some sea life. It was uh, minimal. We saw a couple of fish. We saw some squid. Uh, we saw some plants down there. We didn't see any particular signs of oil, but it was unusual, we thought, that we saw a very little amount of sea life. A particular interest to us was a coral reef, also about 20 miles away from the source of the leak. We went to that coral reef that was about 200 feet down. When we took our camera down there, we did see some sea life. It was an abundance of it, but we did see some fish. The coral seemed to be healthy. But we did see some particles down there that look similar to the particles we were seeing on the surface, those reddish pieces of oil. We don't know what they were. We're letting some experts look at our video to let their learned eye tell us, perhaps give us a little more context of what we were looking at down there. But at this point, it was a very interesting trip through this camera to see what's underneath that oil slick.